What is this? Earthbound, the war against Gygus. Hey everybody, what's going on? This is Clover, and here we are, playing the second game I've ever played on this channel. It's time to play a little Earthbound. That's right. Get a little Mamba going. That's right. We are playing Earthbound. So um, I did a uh, poll um, a couple of months ago and uh, kind of checked out what you guys wanted to see me play or uh, some of you wanted to see me play. If some of you would like to uh, influence my decisions uh, regarding uh, what games we play in the future, then uh, come check me out on Twitter. That's at GamingWick, W-I-K, Clover. Uh, you can, uh, tweet at me there, and sometimes you'll see me tweet and say, Hey, what should we play? This is one of those instances. So here we are. This is our, uh, starting with this new year that we're in. Uh, I'm going to be playing, uh, releasing two videos per week, which is really exciting. So, uh, our second, we'll finish up, uh, we'll finish up Final Fantasy IV as our, uh, first video, uh, during the week. And then, uh, we will, uh, play Earthbound as our second video of the week. So, uh, yeah, let's jump into it. Now, I'm a little concerned because I'm much less familiar with, uh, with Earthbound. I've only played it through once, and I've only beaten it once. We're gonna go text fast. Um, our sound is going to be stereo. <sighs> Please. And what flavor do I want? Hmm. I do like peanut butter. I'm a big fan of peanut butter in real life. I think I'm a go peanut flavor. Name him. Well, I know his name, but uh, what happens if I say don't care? Ness. Okay. So yes, if you don't want to name your character and you want the uh, the names of the actual characters, hit don't care. Uh, if you hit don't care again, I believe it cycles through a uh, list. So um, also her name. What is her name? Paula! Yep, that's right. This is Paula. Okay. And then last but not least, our boy... Luca! Oh, that Jeff? <laughs> I'm sorry, I thought that was Lucas. I guess that's from a different game. But that's Jeff. What else happens if you don't care, don't care, don't care, don't care? Huh. What else? Don't care, don't care, don't care. Let's go back to Jeff. There we go. Okay, cool. And uh, name another friend. Poo! And my pet. Well, my pet I will name, and I will name my pet after, uh, after my cat, whose name is Poopy. That's right. And I think it's a dog. I think you can only have a dog in this game. There we go. Perfect. And then my f favorite homemade food. Oof, that's a hard one. Uh, I think it would have to be steak. Which I know is one of the choices, but I'm gonna throw that on here. Okay. My favorite thing. Uh, games. Music, maybe? I don't know. We'll put games, because we're already there. And this is a gaming channel, so... Okay. All right. So, Ness, Paula, Jeff, and Pooh. Our dog's name is Poopy. And our favorite food is steak. And the coolest thing is games. Yes, I am sure. <laughs> wow! All right, here we go. The crickets are out. The year is 1990X. Onet, a small town in Eagle Land. <whistles> 
Ness's house. Oh, what's happening? <gasps> well, I'm up. Yes, here we are. I am Ness. And, uh, oh, sorry. Um, so, yes, um, you can always check. No problem here. So, yes, if you go into the menu, hit A, you can do a bunch of different stuff. Um, but, um, hmm, I don't remember being, I remember being able to interact with things more, but I guess you can't. And the lights are on. You can hear the, you can hear the, uh, the sirens outside. Here's our sister. Hey, bro! Did the sound wake you up? Were you freaked out? Yes, yes I was, sis. Ooh, and I'm gonna steal her present. No, come on. Okay, Ness opened the present. There's a crack bat inside. Ness takes it. And guess what? I am going to equip it. Bam! Sweet. Um, I've still got Final Fantasy IV on the brain. Uh, I just finished uh, some a recording session with Final Fantasy IV. Hmm. Okay. What was that noise? Ness, you don't seem scared. Are you nuts? And now you want to go check it out? Ugh, okay. You'll sneak out of your room anyway, even if I ask you not to. At least change out of your jammies before you go. Yay! And Mom sends us back to our room to change out of our clothes. Because she's sending us into a dangerous world. Yes, um, one thing for sure about the Earthbound world is that it is filled with horrendous adults. Be careful! Come home as soon as you can! What about Pooch? Besides humans, dogs also sleep at night. Why aren't you asleep? Well, fine, Poopy. And talk to. Beep! So, uh, the phone also plays a big, uh, a big, uh, role in Earthbound, but, um, one thing I do love is the panels. The, it's got such a comic book feel to it. Alright. Ooh. Let me check the, mm, okay. I guess I can. Hmm. Let's talk to this police moon. I want to return home, but the word the road is closed. People are taking this meteorite situation too seriously. I guess he's not a policeman. I guess this is a policeman. Onet police are infamous for closing roads if something is going on. We are going for the world record. Don't panic. It's just a what meteorite that who fell. I just want to what go home. <laughs> Great job, police. Okay. Of course there's no problem here. So I'm gonna follow the road, but, uh, yeah, I just wanted to check around, around my home a little bit. Okay. Did you hear that bang? I th a big bang? I think a meteorite landed nearby. I want to be the first to see it, okay? I'm going to try to be the first to get there. Okay, buddy. I'm much more interested in the homes. Oh, hi. Pokey, my brother, ran out of here to chase after the police car. He said, Picky, you should stay home, so I'm watching our house. Mom and Dad aren't home yet. They went out to an elegant restaurant. Well, I am going to loot your home. <laughs> because nobody's going to stop me, is that right? Hmm. Well, I guess they don't have much here. Check, no problem here. Yeah, I guess there's nothing I can do here. All right. Maybe on to what I'm actually supposed to do. Man, the backgrounds in this game are so chill. I mean, I know, I know other, other uh, music happens, but uh, hmm. I always forget, and hopefully this won't be a struggle for all of you. I always forget how to get up to, uh, to get around in this game. 
But, uh, let's talk to this guy again. Yeah, okay, same thing. Great. Well, let's continue along this road and talk to this policeman officer. Don't you know what time it is? Get your butt home pronto! <laughs> Look at his face. A meteorite has landed. The sharks are running wild in town. You kids are wandering around and... I'm hungry. I hate my job. <laughs> it's dangerous to go to the hilltop. Take this. <laughs> even if you... Even if I advise you not to go... Uh, if Even if I advise you not to go, it won't stop you, will it? No, no it won't, sir. Because that is the point of game to continue, even against good advice. Hey you! Don't you know what time it is? Late, I'm assuming. Late o'clock. <laughs> Alright, let's go get this prezi. I want a prezi. No, I'm not talking. I want to check. I'm sure, like, ooh, a bread roll. I'm sure one of the, uh, one of the buttons is just, uh, check, and I should learn what that is very quickly, otherwise, I'm gonna keep doing this. Uh, no. Hey, Ness! Hiya, buddy! A meteor meteorite fell down and went boom. It was a real mess for a while. I was fine because I always eat garlic and work out to help make my body stronger. However, the weaker citizens probably fainted. I also want you want to tell you, whoops, I almost told you about my, uh, by the way, Ness, did you check my billboard? I wrote the message myself. That's my real job, you know. I'm a billboard guy. Why don't you check out my work? Treasure Hunter. This is Lear X Agarate's house, or Agarate's, or Agarate. Okay. He's a weirdo. The meteorite looks different than usual. It's strange and marvelous as well as mysterious. Ooh! He's very excited. Hey, Ness! Don't be rubbernecking! You're getting in the cops' oops! I mean, officers' ways! You can uh, go home now. Tomorrow, ah, Pokey, we'll tell you more about the strange meteorite. I'm fine here, but you're bugging the officers. Oh, Pokey. Nice timing, Ness. Will you do something about Pokey? <laughs> He's driving me nuts. Are you two friends? Yeah. And you live in the house next to his. I see. Clear out! Get out of my way! 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 Whoops. I... My mistake. I mean, get out of my way. Clear out of my of way out get my. <laughs> this game is so clever. Shh, shh. Okay. Uh, um, uh, 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 uh. You can go home now. Tomorrow, I Pokey will tell you more about that strange meter at. I'm fine here, but you're bugging the officers. You can go home now. Okay. One more time. Yeah. Okay. I always forget what to what to do. So, um, enjoy this, folks. I believe I have to go home. Is that correct? We will see. I wonder when the cops will leave. I wonder when the cops will leave. <laughs> okay, there's these dudes. Uh, nice timing, Ness. Will you do something about Pokey? He's driving me. Yeah, okay. But what if I say no? No. You, you're not friends, but aren't you neighbors? Come on, help me out here. Okay. So... Nothing to do here, I believe, if I remember correctly. We have to go back to my house. Maybe I am wrong. What's over here? Hey, you! Don't you know what time it is, but Okay. So, yes, this is a very, uh... This is a, a fan-favorite game. I'm actually playing this on the SNES Classic Edition, which I, uh, 
was able to get my hands on. I'm very happy about that. Did you hear the baby? Okay, I'm gonna go talk to my mom. I'm gonna go talk to my mom, leave me alone. Welcome home, Ness. It's not necessary to talk about it tonight. It's late, scoot off to bed now. Yes. I believe there's a buzzing about what's going to happen. <laughs> Later that night. Hello? 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 <laughs> Man. Someone's knocking at the door. What an annoying knock. What's happening in your room? Anything? No. <laughs> Playing bongos on that door, man. My land! Who could be knocking at the door that, at this time of night? Would you answer it? Listen to what I gotta say. When I took Picky to the place where the meter rat landed, oh, good evening, ma'am. You're lovely, looking lovely as usual. <laughs> uh, anyway, as I was saying, uh, the police were that were guarding the meteorite uh, landing left suddenly to deal with the sharks. You know the sharks. They're the local ruffians, and uh, they were really looking. Uh, they were really going wild. Suddenly, I noticed that Picky was gone. I, I blame the cops. It certainly wasn't my fault at all. When my dad's back, when my dad gets back, I know I'm gonna get it. You're my bestest friend. Won't you help me find Picky? Yes. Okay, good buddy. Let's blow this popsicle stand. Before we go, why don't you say goodbye to your mom? Don't you agree, ma'am? I know that the dog is unreliable, but you should take Poopy along. The cracked bat in Tracy's room could help uh, out at a time like this. No matter what anyone says, you're a courageous, strong boy. You're my very own natural-born fighter. You'll go far. Remember to go for it! But I think you should uh, change out of your jams before you leave. Yes. <laughs> this is very Pokemon-esque, where the parent sends you on the journey. Even though this was prior to Pokemon. Every, I'll do everything I can to help you. Good luck on your adventure. You might get hungry along the way, so here's a cookie. Ooh, a cookie. You can also leave anything you don't need with me. Do you want me to hang on to something? No. Be careful. I don't even know what I have in my inventory. What do I have in my inventory? Uh, goods. ATM card, bread roll, yeah. Okay, cool. Can I call my dad yet? Beep, no. Okay. The, the the calling your dad is a big part of of the game. Do you want me to go along with you? Yes. I guess I have no choice. Let's go. Yay! Poopy joins you. All right. You go out front and I'll follow at a safe distance. Let's get going. Great. Pokey joins you. A telephone. Ness answered the phone. Hello, it's your dad. Uh, work to exhaustion when you're young. Have you ever heard of a weird saying like this? Just remember, I'm always behind you 100%. Don't be afraid. I know that you're brave. You can do it. Don't forget to call me periodically during your adventure. I can make a record of your progress when you call me. Oh yeah, I deposited $30 into your bank account. Do you have, uh, do you have your ATM card? Withdraw your money from any cash machine and buy whatever you need. Good luck, my boy! I feel like such a hero. What? Well, the father of a hero, at least. <laughs> Slam! Beep. Ness picked up the receiver. Call Dad. It's your dad! Well, ex EXP to get to the next level? Ness 4. Anyway, what do you need from me? Record. All done! Your dear old dad was also thinking about hitting the hay for the night. I've created a record of the adventure to this point. Good night. Sleep tight. Continue. Ness, you work hard. You like to work hard, just like your mother. But I don't think it's good to work too hard. Click. Beep, boop, boop, boop. Okay. So that's how you save. Yeah, sure. You're cool. Whatever. <laughs> okay. Thanks, Mom. All right. 
heading out. All right, and let's, uh, uh-oh. Okay, so yes, we're gonna fight a dog. And if I remember correctly, um, there is a rhythm. Sorry, um. So if I remember correctly, um, you do extra damage by going to the beat of the song. And someday I will destroy this runaway dog. It's really, really hurting me. And the dog became tame. You won! All right. Ness gained four experience. Ness's level is now two. Offense went up by two. Nice. Nice. And we got life up. Hooray. Okay. I'm all blinky because they hurt me. Oh, yeah. I'm sorry. Ugh. What PSI do I have? So PSI is his, uh, is his magic attacks. I only have life up. I don't have any offensive yet. Okay. Great. Missed. <laughs> okay, apologize. Okay. Oof. I'm gonna have to heal soon. Okay, nice. Uh, I didn't want to do it this early, but maybe I should use a cookie or something? So, if you go into your screen while you're being attacked, I don't believe you can be attacked, but, so... Oh. Uh, you know what? Let me use life up. I am gonna get my butt kicked by the bee, that's for sure, but here we go. Alright. Coil snake. <laughs> Plain dead. Oh yeah! This music is so funky, man. Ness gained one EXP. I'm not as big a fan of this music as I am of the music in, say, Final Fantasy IV, or any of the Final Fantasies, for that matter. Because I do like orchestral music better than I like, uh, funk. But, um, no. I mean, ain't nothing wrong with this. Aww. Spiteful Crow dodged. Uh, Spiteful Crow has a big grin on his face. Okay. You won. Ness gained three experience points. The enemy left a present. <laughs> Inside the present, there was a cookie. Ness took it. <laughs> I love the enemy left you a present. That's a normal course of action, correct? Hey, Ness. I was too busy to investigate, but I heard a child's voice on the hilltop. I'm a busy man, but when I do a job, I do it well. I'm a man's man. So I'm hoping that, uh, that we get uh, some gear soon, but as you can see, we are able to make it past, um, the, past the blockade because the police are no longer here. They've gone off to fight uh, a woo! They've gone off to- I knew- if I knew this was going to be such a scary place- Aw, poopy. I wouldn't have come along. I'm out of here. Great, thanks. Bye. Uh, we're gonna go to the meteorite. There's a- uh, the kid. Talk to. What? Oh! You woke me up! Pokey, I've been looking all over for you. You see, uh, Pokey got scared and ran away. Uh, well, I'm glad that you're okay, at least. Uh, let's go home now. I bet Mom and Dad are worried sick about us. Jeez, sometimes I wonder which one of us was the real big brother. <laughs> Yay, we got a... Picky. Yes, that one. Pukey. <laughs> Ness. Do you hear a buzzing sound? Uh, a buzzing that sounds like a bee flying around? Yes. Yes! You can hear it! <laughs> What's happening? Oh no! Ah! A bee I am not. I'm from ten years in the future, and in the future, all is devastation. Gygus, the Universal Cosmic Destroyer, sent all to the horror of eternal darkness. However, you must listen. Where I am from, 
there's a well-known legend that has been handed down from ancient times. It says, when the chosen boy reaches the point, he will find the light. Pass the passing of time will shatter the nightmare of rock, the nightmare rock, and will reveal the path of light. You see, it is my opinion that you are that boy, Ness. This I believe. Gygus's monstrous plan must have been set in motion somewhere on Earth. If you start to confront the enemy immediately, you may have time to counter the evil intentions of Gygus. Three things are of the utmost importance. Wisdom, courage, and friendship. The legends from the ancient times tell of three boys and a girl who defeats Gygus. I will tell you more later. Go now, and do not be anxious about the future. You have much work to do, Ness. Did you listen to what I told you? Yes. Thank you for listening to my long story. Yeah, it was a long story, jeez. You are as exceptional as I expected you to be. Aww. <laughs> Buzz Buzz now joins you. Ness, it looks like you're really in a lot of trouble this time. Three boys, he said, huh? I'm not one of those, am I? Because I'm not into this kind of thing at all. Jeez, my heart is almost pounding right out of my chest. All right, and here we are. Check. Caution. There are still lots of fires burning here, and there's a... It's hot! Okay. Well, so mm, we are on a journey to find two boys and a girl, I believe is what he said. Um... Ness, buddy, I have something to tell you, and only for you. Can you come visit me later, alone? That's creepy, but... Sure. I've got a cracked bat I'll hit you with if you try to do anything. Um, alright. So let's head back home. And see what we can see. Man, I love the creepy vibe of this. It, this game, like, reeks of the 90s to me. It's such a, such a, like... It's imbued with a sense of the 90s. More so than Final Fantasy IV, which is... Oh! <gasps> it's been a long time, Buzz Buzz. You've been successful at foiling Master Gygus's plans. But Buzz Buzz, you must now surrender. You're no longer a hero, but just a useless insect. I'll stomp you hard. Alright. I remember this being horrendously difficult, so hopefully I do okay. Buzz Buzz tried PSI shields. Ness is... Okay. Uh, Picky attacks. One point of damage. Ness attacks. Three points of damage to Starman Jr. Okay. Yeah! Oof. Oof. Yeah. Okay. Ness attacks. Just missed. Uh, PSI freeze. E. Ness is psychic. Okay. So the shield that uh, Buzz Buzz put on me is gone. And I got a psychic shield back. Nice. All right. I probably should have set this to slow. I'm. Uh, this is moving a little too fast for me. Maybe when I eat. Okay. Uh. Yeah. Nice. Buzz Buzz attacks. Uh oh. Uh. Yeah. Woo. We won. I was worried about that. Ness gained 16 experience points. Ness's level is now at three. Defense went up by one. Guts went up by one. Vitality went up by one. IQ went up by one. Maximum HP went up by 12. Oh, nice. Uh, maximum PP went up by four. I get some more PP. Woo! I was taking a big chance there. He came from 10 years in the future to kill me, so we can't relax yet. From now on, you'll be fighting enemies sent by Gygus, as well as hu uh, humans who have evil thoughts. They'll definitely make trouble during your adventure. Animals are also becoming violent, due to Gygus's influence over their evil minds. 
over the evil in their minds. It, it, it is the truth, so listen. Okay. Oh, wait, I'm supposed to get picky and pokey, huh, Mara? Let's do that first. Okay. Returning picky and pokey home. And let's talk to picky and pokey's mom. Where in Sam Hill have you boys been? I be I'll have to think of a suitable punishment. Maybe I don't return them home. Maybe I return home to my to my place first. Yeah, that's probably what's gonna happen. All right, well, we'll go to our place and maybe talk to my mom. Oh, let's talk to their dad. I'm really sorry that my kids troubled you so much. Both of you are really going to get it now. Okay, there we go. Sweet. And their dad's gonna go hit them. Yep. <laughs> oh, this is such a weird game. By the way, I would be happy if you left sometime soon. I'm tired of your family living next door. Well, we've loaned your father a lot of money. It may have been a hundred thousand dollars or more. Well, I guess it, maybe he's just giving us that money. Well, I guess it really could have been less. But because of the loan, my family and I now live in poverty. My husband is much too lenient with children. Oh well, nice guys finish last. That's the story of our life. Oh no. Oh no, Buzz Buzz, no! Ah! I think it's a dung beetle. I'll smash your guts out. No, Buzz Buzz! Oh. Oh, ah, I was much weaker than I thought. You must now begin your adventure. See you. Oh, I just remembered. <laughs> Listen to my final words. To defeat Gygas, your own power must unite with the Earth's. The Earth will then channel your power and multiply it. There are eight points that you must visit. Make these places your own. Each of these locations is your sanctuary. One of them is near Onet. It is called Giant Step. Go there first. Do you understand? Yes. All right. You're a very intelligent young man, and... Oh, the pain! Everything is getting dark. Oh. <gasps> Before I pass on, I want to give you something. It is the Soundstone. You can record the melodies from eight, the eight Your Sanctuary locations into this stone. It's an awesome item. By the way, I'm almost gone. Do you want to hear that story one more time? No, it's okay. Good. It's already dawn outside, but it doesn't matter to me. I'm fading fast. Ah, ah. Aww. Ness got the soundstone. Oh, and Buzz Buzz went away. My husband is very soft-hearted. <sighs> I'm so tired. Nag, nag, nag. All right. Well, folks, uh, this has been a very interesting journey, but uh, I think we should call it quits here for today. So thanks so much for joining me. Uh, on the next, uh, the next uh, step of our journey, we will go to Giant Step and uh, hopefully find a location, uh, a, our location, where we can get the soundstone to sound off. So thank you guys so much for watching. Please uh, come check me out on Twitter. My handle is at GamingWickClover. And if you can, please uh, comment and subscribe uh, and also like this video. It's uh, all of these things are super helpful. Um, if you comment, I will come comment back to you. So thanks so much, folks. I will see you next time on the next episode of Earthbound. I'm so excited to play this with you guys. Thanks. Bye.